Mm, man cannot do, woman cannot do, humans cannot do. Most humans are machines and it's machines that just repeat, repeat, repeat. They cannot do and the whole point of the Gurdjieff work is to be able to become a person that can do, that does do it. Machines have no responsibility, they just repeat, repeat, repeat. But if we can become a person that's aware of what we're doing and not a machine and become the real I, the real person inside us, the essence that's coming together, we can take responsibility for our actions, for our thoughts. But when we're a mechanical robot, we have no responsibility because we're just following the programming that's been given to us and the patterns that we've been brought into. I just wanted to quickly read about how humans are not objective because we're driven by our appetites, we identify with our emotions, we're easily distracted, far too easily distracted, and uh, we say we have aims and goals, but we find any kind of excuse to get out of it, which is why I was doing all these Gurdjieff shows over the last couple of years, to point out the aims <laughs> and the ways to do this kind of work. It is hard work, but once we understand it, hopefully we stop being the mechanical robot that, we're, <laughs> that we are programmed to be, and instead we break free of that programming and become a real person, the real version of ourselves. And I'm just looking at my notes here. It all become, comes down to becoming a free person, a free man or a free woman. And to do this, we need to develop our will because we need the willpower to go forward. Without will, we have no aim, no drive. The will is the drive, I suppose. And we shy away from our consciousness and we also shy away from our conscience when we switch ourselves off and become just a mechanical robot. So hopefully you are aiming to become the real man or a real woman and not be a robot, not be mechanical. And instead, be a true being, be a true human. Find your essence so that you can do the work and develop and break free from all this that's going on. And perhaps lift that veil of Isis, which is what I think this is all about. Lift that veil of Isis and see what's really out there.